Well, welcome back to Nature's Glory Cabin Off-Road. Today's a little different. We're trying to install some rock sliders. Didn't really go as planned. We ended up having to find some professional help to help us with for some mistakes we made. So uh, kind of watch along and hopefully this will save you the trouble as well. Turns out a breaker bar is better than an impact. Watch closely. Okay, we're going to try and get these barricade rock sliders for the JL installed. It's going to require us to do a couple of things, and we're hoping we can keep the factory rock rails. They do come with some washers that allow us to uh, adjust it a little bit. We're going to do it this way. The 18 millimeter impact on our battery-operated Ryobi, the hot rod for the induction heater, and the large tip to go over the 18 millimeter. Let's start doing it. I don't know how long this is going to take, and this just does fit under here so I'm going to have to hold it on there until it gets red hot and then take it off and uh, use the impact we'll try to keep track of time you see we got it on there we're starting to smell a little heat build up Let's see what happens well as you can see it's getting red hot it's almost ready to, it's almost ready to try Well, well, as you can see, it didn't go well. Twisted the head right off of it. I'll take the rest of the body mount part off. So I'm going to take it someplace. They can weld a nut on there and get that out of there. So I just did this so you don't have to. Uh, take your chances if you plan to do it yourself. And here we are at Off-Road and Overland Unlimited in Georgetown, Kentucky. They're going to help me out. They work me in when nobody else would. Appreciate it greatly. Here it is sitting on the rack waiting on the next steps. Look what it looks like to be right. Yeah, so let's do the other one. The washer starts to go on top so it can be used with yep. that. I'm just going to lay them up there and I'll... This is the original bolt that I broke off, and you'll see a little note here on the next one. You'll see the remnants of the red Loctite from the factory, and the new bolt from the factory is using blue Loctite now. And here are the rock rails. I was able to retain the original Rubicon rails in addition to. And special thanks to those guys. I really appreciate it. Hope everybody's enjoyed this. So watch the credits here, and thanks for watching.